everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing my annual Christmas haul. So I hope you guys enjoy! So, first thing I'll be showing you is what's in this bag. This is from class. And if you don't know what class is, it's a homeschool group. So I go there to learn things and my sewing instructor for the year um, gave me and a bunch of other of my student of the students I guess some sewing stuff first off it got hair ties and the reason why I have hair ties is because you can use these to hold the thread on your bobbin so that you can keep things more clean and organized this um, thing guide so you can use it on any sewing machine so it looks like this out of the pack it has a magnet on the back it's kind of helpful I already have one it's not magnetic but it's a screw in one that you can adjust I also got a green tape measure and so you just pull it out and it holds it in place so you can measure things and then you can press the button to let it go and it says measure twice cut once and I got that I got two of these and I think they're the same so I got these heart pins quilting pins they're from Mission Star Quilt Co or Quilt Company so I have like a turquoise green like you guys see now cow green or forage green it's similar to that green and then yellow like a golden yellow and pink and red and white so if you are on YouTube a lot like I am you'll see that people like instead of using pins will use bobby pins or clips so instead of using pins I could use these and she says these are better you could, are easier to use zippers so because the pins don't get can get in the way I guess I never had any issue but yeah I got those and it says sewing clips 50 piece and they're from Madam Sew so yeah um some scissors they have little snowmen and I was about to open them so because I wanted to use them but then I remembered that I could do this video so I didn't so I got these cute little scissors that I can use for anything but probably fabric because you have to use specific things scissors for specific jobs and sewing so so that's what I got so okay so the next thing was a from an Indian friend of ours that went to India because of a funeral, family funeral. Um, so I, he gave me something from this brand if you can read it. I don't know. I'm not Indian, so that's the bag. And then he got me this yellow scarf. And if you guys don't know, my favorite color is yellow, so that's why he got me a yellow one, which he had to go to like a lot of stores to find like the perfect yellow. So I love him. So it's like gold and pretty yellow. Love it. I even had to take a picture to show him what it looked on because he wanted to show his grandma. So I will insert that clip. Okay, so from my parents, I got two phone cases. This is one of them that I'm currently using. This is what the front looks like. It's the other one I got. I don't have a brand for you guys so that you can go buy them, but they're probably off of eBay or Amazon. I got candy in my stocking too. Other presents I got were these three balls of yarn. They're in the color dazzle blue and they're all the same dot dye lot so they're got this game called set this is what the back of it looks like if you want to pause it and read it 
this beautiful navy dress. It is the brand Massini, and it's a small. So it's a navy striped dress. It just has a small slit in the back. What I got for my parents. Okay, so for my grandpa and his wife, not my grandma, pretty gold pendant necklace. The pendant is the only thing that's gold. And the chain is just gold plated, I think is what it says. She's this burgundy long sleeve shirt with this little like I don't even know what it's called. <laughs> Overlap, I guess. But it's really soft and pretty and the bottom isn't straight because it's cut at an angle so it makes a point. Got some jegging black jeggings, but they didn't fit me. I like those because I that's what I got. Okay, so next I'll be showing you what I got from my grandma. I got this little book and it's like really sparkly so and it's really high quality paper so I'm like thinking maybe like a mini sketchbook I got this pen I kind of opened it already but it's gold it's what it looks like um coin it's a nickel the buffalo nickel, I think. This is what the back of it looks like. A certificate, in case you get some view. A penny book, to 1941 to 1974. Penny book, 50 cent state, district of Columbia and territorial quarter folder. And it's 1999 through 19, I mean, 2009 years. Okay, so from my grandma and grandpa, my cousins and my uncles and aunts, I got this jewelry organizer from my grandma. And I don't travel much, like, the most I travel is when I go to milk cow competitions or FRC competitions where we this one has like pocket small pockets for like rings or earrings. I have longer two long pockets for like necklaces or bracelets and the, to get inside them you have to unzip them and it snap has a snap closure to make it kinda like a clutch. It was four eight eight, so if you run that, that's like five dollars. And it has no brand apparently. And it's on a keychain because I was just seeing what it would look like. But it's a Kleenex holder. And then I made this. I did not get this. I just got the Kleenex holder thing. Why it's brighter. Then when I filmed this earlier, it's because some parts of it earlier is because I am now filming on my phone because my camera keeps dying and I put new batteries in it and it's still dead for some reason. I don't even know. A pretty um, necklace. It's like a heart but it's not laying really focused. Oh, there we go. It's from the Artisan Collection. And it says New York on there, so I don't know if it's from New York and they shipped it here or what. It came with earrings, but she took them out because she did. Um, bracelet, it's from Haiti. Yes, from Haiti. And it says, it says that on the back. There we go. And then it just tells you about the organization. My mom's and one of these is mine. 
but I kind of picked out the purple one. So I'm not a big fan of pink, even though my room's pink, but that was when I was younger. But I like them both, and they're, like, I guess they're doilies. And the crochet from, I think, my grandma's mother's yarn. $25 gift card for Dairy Queen. Typical brand that I usually get, which is the sh Peaches and Cream. At least it's one of my brands. I have a couple different cotton brands that I get from. And this one is Fresh Lilac, and then the blue is the Mint. And I feel like I have had the Mint before, but I'm not sure. And then I also got some Comfy Cotton Blend Chai la Latte, I think is the color this which I don't know if I'm going to keep this it's I think it's just like perfume it doesn't smell bad but it doesn't smell good if you know what I mean like I'm not a big perfume people I like hate perfume but it's like not bad like it doesn't make me choke like essential oils make me choke actually but I can't get that through my mom's head when she thinks those are the best. But, you know. So, that's everything. And also, if I didn't tell you what, who gave me what, it's because I didn't remember or I just forgot. Um, so, I got this sticker by number book it's in nature. And so... I, has butterflies. This Discovery um, Crystal Aquarium kit. And I know, I'm gonna maybe make another video, but what I'm thinking about doing is randomly picking a kit to review for you guys. It might be on Instagram, it might not be, but you'll find out how in my next video maybe I don't you guys had a happy new year a Merry Christmas and all that good stuff so yeah bye